Well, Chris, in the past year, nine people have been shot, including three people who died during numerous shooting incidents that happened here in the old Sacramento Waterfront District. Now, that brought out city leaders, community leaders, and business leaders all bringing concerns about that, and now help is on the way. Sacramento's historic downtown for years has been known as family friendly and safe with its many unique shops and playing host to holiday events like the Polar Express, Theater of Lights and a New Year's fireworks show. Michigan native Sylvester Giles says it reminds him of home. And you know, you're always looking for that. You're always looking for that place where you can go and just relax and have a good time. But a series of shootings last year put many visitors and businesses on edge, including a bloody July incident that left two dead and four others injured, prompting city leaders to act. And on Tuesday, Sacramento City Council approving $5 million in federal American Rescue Plan funds to help with safety, including improving lighting, pedestrian access, security cameras, and hiring security guards. $800,000 will go to the downtown partnership to help make improvements right away. These investments uh, are going to really help just the overall sense of security and uh, the guest experience when we're down here. So. Longtime old Sacramento business owner Amor Khan says things have calmed in recent months and hopes these added improvements will help it stay that way. Yeah, I'm looking forward and I'm very excited about that, hopefully. Because honestly, that sounds great. That sounds like what we need. Now, the city's also investing a million dollars in the main downtown area, both to clean it up and to offer some of those added security measures. Our Giacomo Luca starting us off tonight live in Old Sacramento. Giacomo, thank you.